What's up, family? Today, we're going to talk about the power of positive thinking. I know y'all probably thinking, man, like, what's so important with that? What are the benefits of thinking positively? Man, let's get into it. While we wait for it, man, look, go ahead and drop a like. Drop a like right now. Go ahead and like this video. I'm telling you, it's going to be a banger. Go ahead and like and subscribe. Turn your notification bell on, okay? Look, thinking positively can change many aspects of your life for the better. It offers numerous physical, mental, and emotional benefits. Remember that. So let's transform this right here. Number one, man, the reason it improves your mental health is because when you think positively about things, you just reduce your mental stress. It's just common sense, man. You reduce your mental stress and anxiety by promoting positive thinking. So you're being positive about something about instead of being negative. Let's say, for instance, you got a flight. Look, man, every day is full of risk. I hate when people say, you know you can die on a flight. Guess what? The same thing can happen every day you get in your car and drive to work. The same thing. But we don't think about it that way. Because we just don't think that negative about driving a car compared to flying on a plane. But guess what? It's a form of transportation and it can end in the same way if you want it to or if you think that way of it. It can end just the same, man. So sometimes you just got to promote that emotional resilience and overall mental well-being to just prove and show yourself that you can just move forward and stay on path. So, number two, it increases your longevity. Like I just said, it increases your mental, but guess what? Your longevity is also a part of your mental health. You know why? Because when you're stressed out, man, you do stuff like raise your blood pressure. That can go into number three, physical health. So, like I said, one was mental, two was increasing your longevity. Three is enhancing your physical health. Because when you have a better mental well-being, your physical health will follow. Your physical health will follow i just gave you that example with blood pressure that is a real thing man don't stress yourself out so much think about our ancestors think about our elder family members that has high blood pressure you think about you stressing somebody out that's kind of older in your family and somebody's always saying man stop stressing them out don't raise the blood pressure that is real man so therefore you lessen that chance of a stroke on that aspect from the blood pressure aspect. But that's just one less problem. Out of the many, many problems that we have, that's one less that you have to worry about. One. One less problem that you have to worry about. Look, you get a stronger relationship. Stronger relationship, not just with a girlfriend or a boyfriend. Guess what? Stronger relationship with everyone around you. God, you get a stronger relationship with girlfriend for my guys, for my ladies. Get a stronger relationship with your boyfriend. For everybody, you get a stronger relationship with family members, with friends. You just build that stronger relationship because your attitude is better. Your attitude is demanding better communication empathy and then conflict resolution like that is what you are demanding by strengthening your mindset it's really that simple man it's really that simple when you do that it leads to number five greater success you tend to get greater success by being positive being better mentally and physically building better relationships which tends to get you more success. Because I tell people all the time, it's not about what you know, it's about who you know. And if you always bad to people, man, and you are killing, you are killing your network system, you can't do it all by yourself. I promise you, you can't. You need other people. 
it, it, it's nothing in this world that you can do without other people. If you think it's something in this world that you can do without other people, please tell me below. Please. Everything we do is dependent on something. It's nothing that we control 100% by ourselves. So I hate when people act like they don't need nobody. You do. Whether you want to believe it or not, whether you want to acknowledge it or not, you do. You simply do. And that's okay. It's life. It's a part of it. We're in this world. We need people. It's dependent on something. Even food. It's dependent on something. Earth is dependent on something. Everything is dependent on something. It's all dependent on something. It's all about how you think. So, like I just said with that. Six. It increases your problem solving. You don't come to every conflict negative. Thinking it's over, man. I lost my life. I lost my dog. I lost my girlfriend. I lost my husband. You're not thinking that. You're not thinking that. You are coming with a positive approach that challenges creativity and using your resources. Finding the solution you need to move forward from that problem. And guess what that leads to? Number seven, higher level of motivation. You got to have higher level of motivation, man. Look. If you don't motivate yourself, who is going to motivate you? No one. You have to motivate yourself, man. A positive mindset fuels enthusiasm, persistence, and helping you stay focused on your objectives. Which leads to number eight, better stress management. You won't be as stressed out anymore. You won't be. Your mindset is in another world. You won't be as stressed out. You won't be as stressed out. You won't be. You're going to be optimistic about certain stuff. And guess what? That is going to help you view setbacks as temporary. You're not going to take it personal and take it to the heart and think it's forever. No, because you're optimistic about it. So that is telling you that you're telling yourself that you can manage this. You can manage this stress that's going on. You can reduce the negative impact of anything that's coming your way. Man, drop a like if you're still here right now. Drop a like, man. Comment something, man. Guess what that does? Builds your confidence. I got a video about that. It builds your confidence. All of that goes into building your confidence confidence for yourself for yourself because you matter you matter so it's building your confidence for yourself it's building your confidence for yourself because you're focusing on your strengths and accomplishments and you're enhancing your self esteem man. you're enhancing that self esteem and believing in yourself you're simply believing in yourself which leads to our final one. You're just more happy and feeling fulfilled, feeling like you're living with your purpose. You know why you're feeling like that? Because you had that positive thinking to encourage your gratitude and mindfulness when dealing with yourself. You gave yourself that grace. Now, guess what? You got a more joyful and positive and content life, man. So just remember that we can use those 10 things I just listed to just adopt new practices, man, that help us. Different things we can do, gratitude, journaling, mindfulness, and surrounding yourself with positive people, with positive influences that can help cultivate your mind. Cultivate you into having that powerful mindset. You can watch videos like this. Videos like this. That help you. Help steer you in that right direction. So if you want to see more videos like this, man. Just drop a like. And make sure you subscribe. Hit the notification bells. I post videos like this weekly. I post videos like this weekly. Three to five times a week. Shorts. Three to five times a week. So that's six to ten times a week. All you have to do is press this button right here. See y'all later, family.
Thank y'all for tuning in. I love y'all. See y'all next time.